So in this video, I'm going to show you guys how to play this cool little seven stroke roll calypso pattern. I was just kind of experiment the other day with seven strokes and I was like, oh, that sounds kind of cool. And I had a couple things, so I thought I'd share it with you guys. So all this basically, oh, also if you like grooves like this, please check out my book, Tactical Drumming, Groove Survival Guide. I'll put a link for it in the description. And if you dig the video, please like and subscribe. All right, so let's jump into this thing. It's actually pretty simple. Um, and all you're really doing is playing a seven stroke roll. If you don't know what a seven stroke roll is, it is just right, right, left, left, right, right, left. Again, right, right, left, left, right, right, left. One more time, right, right, left, left, right, right, left. Now the key to this is that you wanna be able to get nice strong diddles, especially when you're moving around the kit, right? So we're playing right, right, left, left, right, right, left. For me, you'll notice that I'm using my fingers when I'm playing that to get nice strong diddles. Right, to keep them nice and wide and open, which really helps that be articulated on the ride cymbal, right? So to get this groove going, like I said, I'm just kind of playing the seven stroke roll. Right, right, left, left, right, right, left. Right, right, left, left, right, right, left. But the other things you'll notice is number one, I'm actually accenting that last beat. One E and a two E and, right? One E and a two E and, putting a heavy accent there. The other thing is I'm keeping my left hand really low on that diddle that's happening. So right, right, left, left, right, right, accent. The reason for that is so that the snare drum plays a ghost note when I'm also playing this against the ride. So we've got right, right, quiet, left, left, then two more rights, right, right, and then big fat accent. So right, right, left, left, right, 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 left, left, right, 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 left, left, right, right, right. You'll notice I'm keeping that ghost note super low all right so now what we're gonna do we're very simply going to add the, the hi-hat in there we're going one two three four now at this tempo we need to be able to play our seven stroke rolls a little bit faster so work those up till you're able to play at least here right right left left right right left 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 right so then i'm going to put those between the ride cymbal and snare drum Ready, go. And right, right, left, left, right, right, left. Right, right, left, left, right, 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 left, left, right, 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 right. Then with our bass drum, we're actually just playing this little pattern here, which is boom, 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 right, boom, 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 boom. Typical clips of all pattern in the bass drum. Boom, boom, uh, boom, boom. Then I add the snare and boom. Let's speed it up. And one more jam out. 